What's up everybody? Here's my 2001 Impreza RS Coupe, which I purchased new off the lot in August of 2000 from the Roseville Auto Mall in Sacramento. Over the course of 20 plus years of ownership, I've been able to transform it into a sort of version four, five, six type R clone, I guess you could say. It's got a host of rare and out of production JDM factory optional parts, which we never got. It's got a USDM 04 EJ257 STI swap, which was done by Garage Tuning back in 2007. Brian Keene, who was uh, working at GT at the time, later went on to found iWire, had only done a handful of carb legal harness merges up to that point. And so I tell people that when they get their iWire badge for their swap that I'm pre-serial and Brian I'm still waiting for you to hook me up with a, uh, a badge. Hook a brother up man. Uh, from there we had the uh, engine rebuilt back uh, in 2010, 2011 I want to say and Frank Turcios who was also uh, the engine builder at GT who later went on to found Prolific Autosport in Upland uh, rebuilt the motor and it's been running strong ever since I've got nearly 40,000 miles on this build. It has uh, Molly uh, forged pistons, ACL race bearings, the heads had a five angle valve cut and were re rebuilt to OEM spec. The TGV housings were ported and the uh, bungs for the servos welded shut. It's got a 2019 STI top mount which was donated to me by a customer after we fitted their car with a front mount. It also has the Cobb throttle body coupler and he even threw in the Cobb uh, turbo heat shield. It's a stock VF39 with a Cobb turbo back exhaust. It was pro tuned by Kevin on Dynapax and it made 300 uh, at the wheels and three and a quarter uh, foot pounds. Not the quickest car but it's definitely enough to put a smile on your face and it's still got room to grow. I think the next stage would probably be to do the Mama Tech uh, 11 blade uh, billet we upgrade, uh, center cartridge, uh, parallel fuel lines, injectors, uh, headers, and then retune it and hopefully get closer to four. But for now, I'm happy with where it's at. I've got a few engine dress up things that you know I picked up over the years or were given to me by friends or donated to the cause. I've got the uh, badging from Subaru. Of course, it's my first Subaru and it's still my first Subaru. The Cusco strut brace is one of those parts I probably picked up early on when you could still get stuff from uh, Rennick Cadillac Subaru. Uh, before that, it was ISR. I don't know if you guys remember ISR. They even made their own master cylinder uh, brace. AutoCareSubaru.com for all you OGs who remember. I've got the Billet uh, Eiffel Lail um, filler cap covers. Why does he have two pumps on his washer tank? Maybe because I got that JDM rear wiper, yo. The uh, manifold was recoded. TGVs were ported and deleted. Billet Pro Drive battery tie and oil filler. Can't find that stuff anymore. JDM in fender overfill. I've got the Koyo radiator, which I believe is for a naturally aspirated car because it did not come with the additional bung. I had to weld that on there to accommodate for the return hose to the header tank. Uh, you've got a carbon fiber map cover by C West, another carbon fiber accessory belt cover by Carving Craft, JDM aluminum hood, iWire's fancy intercooler shroud, functioning sprayers, which are fed by a Spec C 12 liter tank. Going to the front of the car, I've got the version 6 grill, which I purchased new from Rennick. The obligatory, not pink, but cherry blossom red eye badge. Behind the grill, you can kind of see the GD or JDM 
STI power steering oil cooler, your obligatory Hella Supertones, STI S202 oil cooler with custom AN lines. The front bumper is STI option sports bumper purchased new from Japan parts back in 2009 that was an 11 or 1200 dollar bumper then good luck trying to find it now the lip is by burnup and I got that from my friend Trey who runs Bakemono he's the guy making all the cool carbon fiber stuff for these cars and I'll probably do another video of the exterior interior of the car with all the other additional JDM bits but for now I just focus on under the hood and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed it and I appreciate your taking the time to watch this video peace